muscle stimulation. Contract those muscles eight times a second. Good morning everyone and welcome to today's video. So I'm gonna be doing a bit of a challenge today. I'm gonna be following Tom Holland's Spider-Man workout routine and also whatever he needs to eat for that role. So I've done a bit of research the past couple days and I've managed to find quite a few workout plans, but the eating side of it was very, like it was not very detailed, but everything kind of says the same thing. So we're just gonna go with that. But of course this isn't gonna be the most reliable, accurate thing because I don't think people are gonna be out there surveying him what he eats in a day. I did a challenge similar to this for Zendaya. I did her workout routine and what she eats in a day as well. And you guys seem to enjoy that, so I thought I'd do the Tom Holland version. They are my favorite couple in this entire world, besides Chuck and Blair from Gossip Girl. Anyway, they're just such like inspiring people. They've done so much with their life at such a young age and they're just like such humble and nice people. Just love what they do. But first of all, we're just gonna get straight into making breakfast. And according to my research, he has eggs on toast with some fruit. I've got a photo of like an Instagram post that was on an article. I'll put it up on the screen for evidence. Quite plain, but let's just get into it. I'm gonna cook the eggs on here because it's just easier. I'm also toast some of this bread. This is like freshly made bakery bed, bakery bread. Breakfast just seems super easy, which is good. And I'm assuming he'd have two eggs. Put the shell in there. Ah. So obviously like for this role, he needed to build a strong physique and I read that he had to put on a bit of muscle before filming. And so having things like eggs and like lean meat, um, that sort of stuff, it's gonna help him put on some lean muscle mass along with like a good workout routine too. He did do some pretty funky things to gain some muscle. I will tell you guys about that after when we get to the workout. I'm just scrambling these eggs because his looked scrambled as well. Also by the photo, it looks like he has a little bit of paprika on it. So I'm gonna add some. That's like the little red stuff in it. Yeah, these websites just aren't very detailed which makes it hard when doing these videos. Bread seems to be done. And then also along with his breakfast, he had some raspberries, like just a punnet of raspberries. So I've got some here. Okay. So random. And he also had some orange juice. By the photo, it didn't look like he had anything on, like with the bread. It was, it was just eggs and bread. He likes to have complex carbohydrates rather than things like white bread, just because it's just healthier for you. Lower GI. And especially if he's doing long days, filming, working out, you're gonna need more sustained energy. Isn't that lovely? Delicious. Yeah, it's definitely a bit dry without some avocado on the bottom. That's what I'm used to. Not bad. I like all this stuff and I normally eat this sort of way like every single day anyway. So is isn't that much of a difference. I do like how the raspberries are included. Um, I love raspberries. I haven't had them in ages though. I do like this breakfast. It's nice and balanced. You've got protein from the eggs carbohydrates from the wholemeal bread, orange juice and raspberries and you also have a bit of healthy fat coming from the eggs too. So I'm just about to head to the gym now. I'm a little bit nervous because this workout seems quite intense. I mean which is what you would expect but I'm also like a bit nervous to film because I just don't want the gym to be busy and it's just like awkward using my massive tripod because did my first like filming in the main part of the gym with this big camera and my tripod the other day had all of this stuff filmed and then I accidentally deleted the footage so like this is my redemption day it's just a bit nerve-wracking like it's so awkward um yeah I'll see you guys when I get to the gym and I'll go through the workout so I've just gone to the gym and it is packed it's gonna be hard to film but I'm gonna do it anyway because I don't really care so I'll quickly go through the workout that I've got to do today all right we've got chin-ups three sets three five and seven reps uh the dips 10 reps we've got sit-ups We'll figure it out. Um, all right. Uh, let's go. So we are starting off this workout with some chin-ups. Um, he probably does them like with his own body weight, but I'm not at that strength level yet. So I'm doing it with the assisted machine. 
but I did it on the lightest weight that I could, just so it's giving me the least amount of help as possible. And then I moved into three sets of 10 tricep dips. These are all right, they weren't too bad. And then I had to do 25 sit-ups and oh my gosh, my abs were very sore, but mainly because yesterday I had to do a workout with 10 minute plank. Um, but yeah, 25 sit-ups, let's go. Next exercise was 25 kettlebell swings. Um, by this point I was getting quite sweaty and quite tired. And then I had 10 Spider-Man push-ups. I obviously have not got the best form with this, but I was trying and I was actually quite proud of myself looking back at this video. Like, it isn't too bad, it isn't great, but it's getting there. And then I had to do 25 burpees, which was absolute hell, but we pushed through and we did it. And then we had more sit-ups. We had another lot of 25 sit-ups. And then I grabbed out the box, which was very heavy, and I did 25 squat jumps. I kept getting like a bit dizzy, so I had to stop and take like a bit of a break, but it was okay, we managed to do it in the end. And then I finished off this workout with the 100 meter sprint. I did it twice. I was meant to do it earlier in the workout, but there was just so many people and I couldn't even get a treadmill, so that's okay. But yes, I was absolutely dead by this point and was just exhausted. Oh, okay, we did it. You gotta open up these windows. Oh, okay, um, that was very good. I actually really liked that workout. I feel like it was less challenging than Zendaya's, maybe because I wasn't out in 40 degree heat in like the scorching sun, but there was a lot of like body weight exercises, which surprised me. I thought there'd be like quite a bit of weight stuff. The website did have like different workouts, like Monday he does this, Tuesday he does that, blah, blah, blah. But yeah, I don't know how accurate it is, but it was good and it was challenging and I am very sweaty right now. One thing that I found out that he did to get the physique that he needed for this role, let me get the terminology up. Routine consisted of a lot of um, like agility, cardio, hit sort of stuff because in his role he obviously needs to do like a lot of different movements and gymnastics sort of stuff so it wouldn't be the most beneficial thing just to do weight training he needs stuff that's a bit more a bit more movement to it and a bit more agility he had to do this sort of like specialized training which is called ems and it's electric muscle stimulation um, and i'll just read this out to you it works by sending low level electrical currents through your body to stimulate muscles so this suit can give you a two hour workout within 20 minutes and apparently it is the most brutal 
20 minutes ever but that is one of the secrets of how he built so much muscle this is a quote from tom holland i do it on top of my gymnastics trainings and it is a lot of good fun it's I strapped into a suit that covers all the major muscle groups in your arms legs and full torso the machine has the ability to focus on specific body parts and it sends pulses that contract those muscles 80 times a second 80 times a second that's cool so i mean he obviously worked out on top of that and followed a good like diet but that was like a little bonus thing on top that was interesting 80 80 a second that is all so i have gotten home and i realized that he has a snack in between breakfast and lunch and it is a protein shake. Again, none of the websites told me what was in the protein shake, but I'm just gonna assume it's just protein powder, like water or milk and a banana. I can't really be too accurate when they just say protein shake. Um, I'm going to be using the Tropica Sarah's Day protein on banana. I do love good protein shake. Like I've honestly, I've gotten sick of having like fruity smoothies. I just love having banana, almond milk, ice, and protein powder. I normally am a botanical blend sort of girl, but this one is fabulous. Delicious. Okie dokie, so I have just washed my car and done a bit of running around. And it's time to make some lunch. Now again, they didn't give us much detail. I apologize. But every single website just said that he has fresh vegetables and lean meat. Like, what is that meant to mean? So I'm just assuming it's like a salad because fresh vegetables equals salad. Lean meat, that's like chicken. So I grilled up some chicken yesterday and so I might just like put it all together in a salad. Also got a bit of capsicum. This one feels a little soft. Ugh. Just gonna cut it really fine. I'm gonna have some spinach as like the base. Just, ugh, not you. And we've got these little chicken bits. I'm just gonna cut them up. Um, this is just chicken breast, which makes it a lean meat. And I just cooked it on the barbecue with some like herbs and stuff. Now this recipe did not mention any dressing, any add-ins nothing so it was just this so i'm just gonna go by this but this is tom holland's lunch i definitely feel like you followed like lunch recipes like this you would get super lean and you would get very much in shape so this makes sense but it actually looks really nice okay the camera quality is just like being really weird right now i don't know what is happening anyway um i've just gotten back from work i'm gonna make some dinner now for dinner he has lean meat potatoes and vegetables so I'm just using the air fryer. Um, so I've got these roast potatoes. They are rosemary and garlic. So cold. So I'm gonna chuck some potatoes in. Okay. I'm also gonna chuck in some vegetables too. I normally do these on the barbecue, but I'm just gonna chuck them in here with like a bit of oil. and I'm just gonna add in some roast turkey as my meat um I did try and get like the proper roast turkey like the one that you have on Christmas but there was none in the store besides a whole chicken and I did not want to be dealing with a whole turkey anyways this is my final meal of the day like this milk plan just feels so healthy because everything is like raw natural ingredients there's nothing processed nothing packaged so yeah i'm feeling good feeling healthy so this is my dinner tonight delicious so i'm probably going to wrap up this video now because that is all my stuff for today done but overall i actually really enjoyed this workout and meal plan his meals are very very simple and very clean and healthy yeah as i said before like it's all just so 
natural, not processed, like nothing like that, which is great. And I definitely want to implement this sort of stuff more, even though I do eat very similar to this. It just is a like good refresher on eating like natural foods rather than like going for processed sort of stuff. It just makes you feel a lot better and a lot like lighter throughout the day. You don't feel so like full and like blobbish. Um, but yeah, I really did enjoy this challenge. And I hope you guys enjoyed watching it too. But yeah, if you guys want to check out my Zendaya one, I will link that below as well. But I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you did, please give it a like and subscribe. And I'll see you all in my next video.